Hey, feminine. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. Let us see what the messages are that Spirit has here for you on today. Please do keep in mind, you all, these are general messages. Only take what resonates with you and leave the rest. All right. Let's go ahead. Let us see. All right. I keep seeing this card. So somebody has been made to feel rejected, either you or your person. Okay. Due to the other one being a little bit withdrawn at this time. Okay. We have only you, devoted, attached, and crave. Okay, so somebody is craving you. Okay, trust your intuition. What is it telling you when it comes to this person, when it comes to this situation? What do you feel is the truth? Okay, let us see. Ancient spirits. Okay, we have escaping, avoiding, blocking, and pushing away. Withdrawn. Okay, single, lonely, solitary. Spending a lot of time to self. Okay. We have distance, separation, space, and blockage. All right. Ecstasy, chasing thrills, excitement, good time. Okay. And what else? Take one more of these. Get into the tarot. All right. We got conflict, clashing, differences, and compatibility. Underlying energy chasing all right it says pursuit toxicity and resilience i feel like some of you have been going through this with somebody for a really long time one minute they're there next minute they aren't okay you could feel like this person is just simply around for a good time you might be right okay you might be right again listen to what your intuition is telling you this person is missing you or you're missing them but what does that mean okay let us see spirit. this person may want you to chase them you're like, I'm not doing that. Okay. If you're wanting this person to chase you, this could be why they've fallen back. They're not doing that. Okay. Let us see. Thank you, Spirit. We have the Knight of Swords. Somebody's coming towards you. They're coming towards you quickly. All right. Yep. Double emphasis on that. There's a lot of speed here. This person wants to talk. Okay. They want to talk about something. But as far as you're concerned, you feel like this person is in and then they're out. They're in and then they're out. They're drawn to your energy. It's everything about your energy. It's an emperor, divine master. Okay. Let us see. We have the moon. We have a two of pentacles. Okay. So this could be somebody that's used to people chasing them. You're not going to do that. Whenever you feel like this person is operating out of ego, perhaps you just fall, you know, fall back. Okay. Fall back, fall back. Okay. The sun. This person is coming towards you because you make them happy. All right. Star card, sun card. They feel like it's a destined connection. It's something that's meant to be. All right. The chariot. They want to take things to the next level with you. But again, there's been distance between the two of you for some reason or another. Okay. Let us continue. Let's see what we get. Two of swords. It could be distance between you because of the conflict. Like perhaps the two of you are not able to get on the same page when it comes to something you've been communicating about. Ace of Pentacles. They want to make an offer to you, but in order to make that offer, we have to be on the same page. Resistance. Somebody could be resisting the other one. That's what they feel. It's like, you're resisting making me chase you. So either you feel like that or they feel like that. Put yourself with the other side. Okay. Okay. Ten of Pentacles is building together and the Six of Pentacles is reciprocity. So in order to build together, it has to be equal. You know, if I'm contributing energy to the connection, so should you. If I'm giving to the connection, so should you. In any event, you or they feel like the other person isn't, then that's why somebody has withdrawn. That's why somebody has pulled back and went within, okay? We have the Page of Cups and the Knight of Wands. But there is reconciliation, an apology coming in. This person wants to make something right, okay? They may want to have some makeup sex here for some of you, all right? But you're in this serious I'm not playing with you type of energy. You know, you want to be in union with this person, but you've done a lot to heal yourself, all right? No more confusion, no more chaos, no more uncertainty, heartache, no more sleepless nights. You know, you're not crying no more. So it's like you're thinking about things that have happened in the past here with this connection, and you just don't want to repeat, okay? You do not want to repeat history. We have Page of Wands here. Good news, exciting news. Okay, we have this guard up against this person. Again, you don't like the conflict. You don't like the back and forth. Okay, we should be able to communicate and express what it is that we feel. 
in a civil way, okay? The Ace of Pentacles, again, my engagement ring, they want to make an offer to you. Some of you could have been engaged to this person, called the engagement off due to, like I said, just not being able to get on the same page when it comes to some things, things that really matter, okay? We have the Knight of Swords and the Eight of Wands. Okay, we have the devil, all right? The devil is fear. The devil is obsessive thoughts, okay? So somebody could be thinking about you a lot and afraid of what that means, you know? Does that mean that I'm in regret over having let this in? And should I do something about it? Ace of Wands, okay? This person has definitely been stressing, though, behind the scenes. Could just be about their responsibilities and obligations. And then this card confirms it, okay? It says turbulence, tension, arguments. So it could be the stress from the disagreements between the two of you. Stress that this person has just been dealing with in life, okay? Two of Pentacles and the Moon. That could be what it is, you know, keeping everything balanced, keeping everything afloat and keeping it private. Not telling you what they're going through. Again, with that withdrawing, okay? So they could have been taking some of their frustration out on you, which was causing conflict. Okay, we have the Three of Wands, very near future, person's coming towards you, okay, after having pulled back, after having been closed off, okay, Nine of Swords, they're worried, I'm coming back now, is it too late, Seven of Wands, because you're protecting yourself from them, you're keeping yourself in this protective bubble, and not really letting them through, not letting them in, okay, Sun card, focused on your happiness, focused on the things that bring you joy, Nine of Wands, keeping your guard up, person is in their head thinking a lot about you they're watching you spying on you as well wanting to reunite here praying on divine intervention some of you just simply don't believe this person anymore you have like i said emotionally withdrawn it's like they withdrew first then you turn around and mirrored them and now they're coming back wanting to reconcile with that page of cups knight of wands okay sun card and the page of swords in reverse so you move on you're happy this person sees you're happy. You're getting your heart's desires, wish fulfillment. This only makes them feel worse, okay? This doesn't make them feel better because they wanted to be a part of it. But because of whatever they had going on, they couldn't be a part of it or something like that. All right, we have the Sun card in the Page of Swords in reverse. Mm, the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, it's like them wanting to come towards you but never having moved their feet. Again, you know, having held back, whatever it was. They want to take that energy and transmute it into something else. They want to make it into something else. I didn't make the offer then, but I want to make the offer now. You know, Knight of Pentacles, Six of Wands. I want to bring this to your awareness at this point, okay? I want you to know how I feel at this point. And see, is this the Emperor? Yeah, how you feel about it, okay? Because they can't stop thinking about something. I mean, you could have been with this person or tried to do a relationship, just felt like it wasn't working out. So, you know what? Never mind. Left it alone. They can't stop thinking about it. They feel like, you know, that would just be giving up easily or we have judgment and nine of cups. They feel like you're their heart's desire. So, it's something we're fighting for. This connection, this relationship is something we're fighting for, in their opinion. All right. With the King of Swords, it didn't come from a simply emotional, you know, just putting my F and E's in it type of place they came from a logical i've thought about this analytical place you know they're coming from a intuitive knowing place okay so yeah let's see the tower this may be a shock to you a surprise to you something that happened suddenly out of nowhere this person wasn't in commitment with you but the magician and the high priestess they should be together okay the higher fans commitment marriage okay as they feel they feel like you're their uh counterpart you're their equal, okay? You're their other half, however it resonates for you and with you. All right, Knight of Wands, Page of Cups. The Ten of Swords, okay? This is an abrupt ending to something, okay? They want to apologize for everything having ended so quickly. Again, they didn't put the amount of work in that they feel like they could have or should have, and they want to now. Okay, yeah, the star card. They're praying for that opportunity. The seven of pentacles. Now, I'm not going to say that they deserve another chance or nothing because I wasn't there. But I'm going to say that with these two energies, it seems as if they're going to get what they're wanting. Okay, so if you don't want it, child, you could have fooled me. Because with the nine of cups and the star card, it's like double wish fulfillment. Okay, 
The four of swords is meditation. This person could be meditating on this. Yeah, pulling on your energy. Wanting to be with you. Okay? Yep, that's what's going on. So we have the page of wands here. Okay. Nine of Pentacles. Single, independent, doing their own thing. They're thinking about you. Okay, that could have been it. You could have been in a place where you just didn't need any distraction. They didn't want to cause any stress for you. They had their own stuff going on or something. All right, nine of Pentacles. Page of Wands. Yeah, so this is why you're so serious. You built yourself up. So even though this is your person and you would love the Ten of Cups situation, this may even be something you daydream about and fantasize about all the time. You're still going to set healthy boundaries with this person. Yeah, Nine of Wands. In any event, they don't respect that. Well, whole different story, you know. Whole different story at that point. We have loyalty, trusting, reliability, and believing. Okay, they want to prove their loyalty to you. We have one day, yeah, one day at a time, someday, somewhere, another time, okay? One day at a time, chemistry, yeah, you're conflicted because you feel this chemistry with this person, but, I mean, until they prove their loyalty, which up until now, I feel like maybe they haven't, obviously. Just gonna be like this. Yeah, this is the truth. You have clarity on the situation now. I feel like they do as well. Again, yeah, divine feminine, you have your boundaries up. This person, they are craving intimacy with you. They want to confess some things that you know what's been going on. But this person thinks that it might literally be over this time, you know? Some of you could have been on again, off again with this person for a while, which is why I said this time. Like, they feel like this could be over this time. That's the way that it came out. Okay. So that tells me that this person... You know, been somebody that's been around for a minute, on again, off again. For some of you, like I said. All right. Like I said. Okay, we have respect. We have karmic relationship, okay. We have soon, okay. Yeah, they could have been exiting out of a karmic relationship. Yeah, we have abundance and reunion, okay. So it's meant for you to have a prosperous, abundant union with this person. Yeah, they're full of regrets, you know, have I let go of something I was meant to hold on to, and then you have anger. There's no such thing as, you know, making those type of mistakes. What's meant to be will be, and that's just that. You know, it might not be happening at this very second, but it doesn't mean that it will not happen, especially when that's what Spirit says is supposed to happen. All right, so I pray that this helps you. I know that it will. If this was your reading or you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up, and if you have not already, go ahead and subscribe. Peace and heavies.